Hello everyone, this is James. Welcome back to more RimWorld. Today I'm starting at the loading screen because I had to go over some interesting news. Um, so the mod developers have decided to release their version beta 19 of their mods. What that means for us is they replaced the beta 18 versions in the workshop with the beta 19 versions with which broke the mods that we had installed. Uh, they have other alternatives. They could have just opened up a new workshop entry, updated beta 19 to a new entry, left the old ones alone so everyone didn't have to go fix their games because they decided to release it. So that's their decision on how they release things. A little inconvenient for the people trying to utilize their great work. Uh, the Three mods that are impacted by this are Hugslib, very important to a lot of the other mods we've got going on in here. It's a library that gives a lot of them functionality. Our allow tool, I use it a lot, saves me tons of time, tons of headache, had to be in there. EDB prepare carefully, could have probably done without it. We're not starting a new world, but I wanted it in there just for completion. The other two, in the description, they have a link to where to get the beta 18 version. Go in the workshop, hit the subscribe button. It'll automatically download. EDB, prepare carefully. They gave you a link on where to find the manual install. So I've gone ahead, I've done that. Not within the scope of this video for me to show you how. I will probably release a future video on how to install mods in RimWorld. So we'll go over that when the time comes. Today, we're going to get back into the game. So we're going to go ahead and load up our colony, the Lost Plague, Mods Mismatch. We're going to load anyway, hope for the best. I guess we'll find out if we're starting a new season already. Um, if we are, it's out of my control. Maybe we'll do a Beta 19 branch if anything in this is completely broken. It looks like it loaded up okay. Everyone's asleep. Sims, Willy, Coyote... Uh, Merendil, yeah, that's the word. They're all in here, they're doing great. We're gonna go ahead and speed up time, get things moving. So, I think it's time to start pre preparing for research. We should probably start thinking about, um, oh, look, uh, last episode we were already doing that. Um, we've got some space in here. We will expand out, let them get caught up in the work that they're doing. And they need marble cut. Let's see the bills. We will move marble to the top. They need to be doing that first. Oh, we have visitors. Jump to location. A uh, handful of guys. We'll talk to them when they get out. Marcus learned learned go ahead and clear these out get them out of the way so this is Erison, the researcher from the northeast Irium, which we are currently mostly friendly with they don't hate us i wouldn't call us friends but they don't hate us uh, sims i believe is our socialite so we will have him talk to them we have some flake we want to get rid of, some wake up we want to get rid of. Not really willing to play the risk of all of those drugs being in the colony. Don't have the time or energy to deal with. Oh, they. Oh, well. Oh, push the wrong button. Where'd he go? Uh, sim, sim, sim. Where did he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? We lost. There they are. Go ahead and start that over again. So apparently they, they were a little broke. Um, we will give them... Oh. Okay. I need to pay better attention. We went ahead and accepted it anyway. I'm just happy to get the drugs out of the colony. We don't need any of that drama up in here. Sims is making great progress over there. Limestone walls being put up. Who's working on this? Harvesting heel root. Building limestone wall. Aaron Jill, hauling stone, sandstone. Why aren't we doing marble? 
Oh, I guess we are doing marble. Ah, it's Marindol making stone blocks from chunks. And that... Oh, how nice of you. Oh, our little visitors are helping around the colony, moving stuff around for us. That's very courteous of them. I really appreciate their help there. Saves us some trouble. I'm really liking these refrigerators. Um, it saves us from having to have giant storage fridges. Not really very efficient, uh, to tell the truth. These do generate heat, I believe. They don't really say. I don't know. Oh well. We'll, uh, we'll roll with it. Everyone's sleeping. Everyone's comfortable. Uh, looks like... Oh, everyone but, uh, G over here got a bed. But, you know, he gets his turn. There's plenty of beds in here. You know, they should be happy that they even get to sleep. Uh, everyone thing in here is looking much nicer. A little bit cleaner than it was before. Clean room, slightly dirty, slightly dirty, clean, dirty. Doing a lot better. Making really good progress on the floors. The research bench going. Wait for more of these walls to get put in. We'll dig out the collapsed areas. Making good progress. You know, and that's the thing with RimWorld, is we'll sit here. Everything will seem to be going normal. Everything will be boring-ish. Because we're just kind of going through making the progress. The second I go to cut away and say, I'll be right back. We'll get attacked. That's just how it works. Inspiration work friends. Ooh, who's that? Willie. Work 2.5 times faster. That is wonderful. Orders. Come on, let's go ahead and knock those out. Willie, Willie, Willie. All right, you're doing great. Glad to see you moving and getting all of that done. We have lots of work to do. Like I said, we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and strip most of the resources on the map, um, just for the simple fact that the map doesn't need it. It's ours. Let's go ahead and get that cleared out. Order structure. We'll cancel. We'll cancel that one. That one. That one. It'll give Coyote some work to do. There's always more work that needs to be done. Now I'm just going to continue to make it difficult for them, continue to pile it on, and they will happily take care of it for us. Keep going. Sims, you are doing great. Happy, happy you're here with us today. Happy you're here with us. Just got to keep him going, keep him happy. Almost there. Almost there. Look at all of that flooring. I bet y'all are ecstatic. Y'all are doing wonderful. We'll see if we can't get caught up a little bit. Medicine. I should build a hospital room. Oh no. A crazy rabbit. Whatever shall we do with insane rabbits? I say we restrict our people to area one. And we will designate that area now, area one, as in here. We'll let, we'll expand that too. Um, we're gonna let our guests deal with that crazy rabbit. It's not our problem. You know, and if they get bit and beat up by a rabbit, it's kind of their fault, you know? Come on, go out the door. Go out the door, get into a fight with a rabbit. There you go, there you go. There you go. Free food for us. There you go. Do we... 
you might want to get out of here. Ooh, they enjoyed our stay. Left us ostrich leather, cowboy hats, Ken Fuel, Panther, medicine. Wow. Jackpot. That is awesome. Haul all of this into the stockpiles. Get that stuff done. I'm really happy with that one. Whose job is it to clean? That is Willie. Oh, poor Dwee. You're gonna collapse before you get out, aren't you? Mm. I'm so sorry to see. There we go. See that? That's what I was expecting to happen. So what we're gonna do we're going to go ahead and rescue. We're not going to capture, we're going to rescue. We're going to play nice. Ooh, fancy meals. Haul that urgently. I need those fancy meals. And who is our doctor? Sims. Please. Save Dwee. Who got beat up by a pack of rabbits. Oh, 48. Look at that social, fast walker, too smart. But you got a bad back, and I am nowhere near the capabilities of being able to manage a bad back. So we're going to go ahead and let you do your thing. But you're no longer at a major risk. You're welcome to leave. It's up to you. It's going to take you a while. Hopefully you don't find a hug hungry warg on the way. All right, we got lots of progress over here. They are completely done with that. We'll go ahead and block that in. So we've got some power needs over here. Go ahead and run this around the back wall. Cancel that one. Let them get that all plugged in. I think we're going to move our battery bay over here. Power. Get our power overlay going. Cooler has broken down. Not a major issue. We'll go ahead and connect these wires there. That way when I pull this, everything doesn't completely shut down. Incapacitated refugee. Uh, that's really far away, and I'm feeling lazy. We're gonna go back home. We've got too much work to do to deal with any of that. Now these self discharge rate of five watts. Um. Charge batteries tend to explode. It's good enough. It's good enough. They're going to be in an area that is highly unlikely to ever encounter fire. And reinstall this there. Reinstall that there. Reinstall that there. All right, let's look at our power overlay, make sure we don't have any gaps. Wire running there, wires running there. Everything seems happy. Power. So, we've got our research bench up. We have to get started on some things. Um, we have to get our power situation done because I would like to have the circuit breakers. Circuit breakers are fairly important. There we go. Research that. Requires high tech research bench and multi analyzer. So we're going to let's make it prettier in here. More floors. 
marble. Let's go with that. And we want to do another research bench. We could make it out of other things. So the research speed factor, base value. All right. So let's see what this does. Collect that. Speed factor, room cleanliness. It's outdoors. How is it outdoors? That's not outdoors. So an area, build roof. There we go. That should fix that problem. Simple research bench, 58%. Cleanliness, base value. Room cleanliness. So, we have to figure out how to improve that research bench efficiency. Do a quick Google search. So, uh, building research bench outdoors, improve the penalty. Okay, so they recommend chairs at the bench to keep them comfortable. I can understand that. Furniture, furniture. I'm blind. Dining chair. Let's see, armchair. Do I have... Maybe we don't have cloth. Panther? No. Ostrich? No. Turkey? No. Hair? No. Squirrel? No. Um... So we're going to go with a dining chair for the moment. We're going to put it here. And we're going to require it to be excellent condition. Well, go ahead and let that run. And we have plenty of lumber get that completed. Heel root is happy. Tiny bit of food. Potato plants are growing. And we have a raid. A group of pirates from the face beaters. Looks like they want to use sappers to tunnel around your defenses. Well, that'd be a huge waste of time unless they come in through here then we'll still be able to hit them. Let's jump to location. So we've got a guy with grenades who's going to dig at sandstone. And a guy who's got a machine pistol. Okay. Let's everyone to your defensive positions. We'll just... Really? That? Okay. I'm not quite sure what their plan was. But, yeah. So we'll do this. We'll go... You'll be a prisoner room for the time being. Y'all are all released. Your job is to strip Crawford. And then you're going to come over here. You're going to haul. And Sims, you're going to capture Crawford. And somebody haul that guy. Somebody haul that. Somebody haul that. Somebody... All that. So Crawford, who are you? What do you do? Capable of firefighting, lazy. You're nervous. But you've got a green thumb. 
but you don't like growing. Awesome. You do like doing medicine. You like animals. You enjoy mining. You'd be useful. You know what? We are going to attempt to recruit you. We'll give that a go. So with that, we absolutely need to move forward our defenses and start expanding our base forward. Build copies of that here. We will one, two, three, four, five. We'll get all of that put in. Structure, wall, then go with granite. I want to come up across here like this. Orders, mine that out so they can get in. We're going to start with a basic defensive wall. Y'all can get that done when you get it done. No major rush. Just make progress. Getting all of this done fairly quickly. We're going to stop that from being a medical bed. That way Sims can get some sleep at night. He works very hard for us. Willie, ah, oh, restrict, unrestricted. Get back to work, Willie. There you go. Lots of work for you to do. All that dirt, all that blood needs to get cleaned up and out of our area. All right, so we're making good progress. I'm gonna let this run a minute. We will be back in a few after if anything happens, I'll bring you back. If nothing happens, I won't bring you back until they have made progress on all of the work that we have asked them to do. So I will be back in a few. All right, we're back. So it seems that we have a refugee that would like to join us. His name is Humps. He is a dusty farmhand as a child and a dromedary knight as an adult. Uh, he's got bloodlust, neurotic, he's greedy, and he's incapable of intellectual, architect, artistic, or hauling. So, not my favorite guy. Um, he's going to be decent at crafting, he's going to be decent at melee and animals, and he's okay at medicine, but I'm not sure. Uh, he might be okay dealing with other people, but he's more likely to start a fight. Uh, so that could be problematic. Um, all right, so we'll we'll work with him. We'll see what the attack looks like. Uh, we'll try to make the most of it. Um, still lots of progress to be done. I started telling them to make another room. Um, we're going to go ahead and have everyone get to battle positions. And Humps, you can go get the... LMG, that works. Sims, you're gonna go here. Command the steel turret. And that's your new position. You go here. You are, that's your new position. You are going to move here. That's your new position. You have a steel shiv. You can move here. That's your new position. And you, you're gonna come over here too. You're gonna move right there. And that's your position. Well, that's unfortunate. So what we're going to do 
that wall needs to go away immediately. Sims, you come on off of that. Deconstruct that wall right now. Actually, you just go man the turret. This is bad. Real bad. Thomas may be dead. He just arrived. He may already be gone. Colonist needs rescue. Oh no. It was horrible. Alright. We're going to turn this into a prison. That's a medical room now. You. Go. Take him to his bed. You. Rescue humps. Uh, everyone's undrafted. No, everyone's undrafted, not drafted. Crawford, take him to his new location. Willie, rescue. You, capture. Anyone else to capture? No? No? Everyone else is... Everyone else died. Okay. Um, haul all of these urgently. We will cancel deconstruct on that. Haul, 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 haul. Now, how bad is the damage? Sims, what are you doing? You don't have a bed. Because you haven't built it yet. Sims, we're going to prioritize you with building because we need to get you done. And since we did just survive that, I think we're going to come back to seeing how these guys do at the next episode. Thank you all for joining me today. Uh, this was RimWorld Beta 18. We are going to really continue just trying to build our wall. In the next video, get it reinforced. Try to get an actually defensible position set up. Um, try to reinforce. Try to get more rooms done. Uh, try to recruit these guys because we can't keep getting nothing done. I really don't feel like we're making great progress. We are spending too much time on food. I think we can cancel all of that for now. Um, we are going to suspend food making. We are going to tell uh, Willie to spend less time growing, less time hunting. You can cook or craft. You can clean. You can craft. Um, heck, you can even research if you want to. We'll build, build extra research benches. Let them really get going. We're going to get these all the rest of this work sorted out very soon. We need to just get progress done. Uh, but this was more Rim World for you. I'm James. If you liked what we gave you, go ahead and subscribe and hit the notifications. We will see you in the next video if you do. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, hit the likes. If you didn't, hit the dislike. Um, you know, let us know what you think down in the comments. How can I better entertain you? And I will see you in the next video.